Yo, what up? Welcome to another gaming video. Um, I'm back. New cut, new everything. Um, speaking of a new haircut, I got some other new stuff in store for y'all. Um, instead of just my webcam, you guys see on screen right now, is gonna be where I play um, my games, and you'll obviously see me uh, use the keyboard and stuff. So, hey, what up? I'm recording at the same time on this camera, because it is currently plugged in and on PC mode, so I can see this. You guys can also see my monitor. I did not mean to hit the camera. You guys can also see my monitor and how I record. Uh, if you guys want a um, recording video, I'll be sure to get that out and show you guys how I record my videos. But, yeah. Just wanted to show you guys that. Hope you guys thought it was pretty cool. And uh, it's going to be here for a while. But if you guys want any changes with this or anything else on the channel, let me know in the comment section down below. And I'll be sure to figure out a way to change that for you guys. But, yeah. Today's game is going to be a game. I have the icon popped up, like, in the corner. It's called Found Horror Game 11.exe. Or so something like that. You guys will see the icon. But we're going to be playing this game. We're going to be playing the first game. I think it's called Attendant is what I think. I believe that's what it's called. But there's like an introduction that we got to go through. So we're going to go through that. I think it's with the game developers. So we're going to go through all that and then play the game for the first video. So without further ado, hit my intro and we'll get straight into the action. Hey everyone, this is Duskolm aka Aesthetic Gamer, and welcome to Found Horror Game 11.x. See, some people say .x, I don't like when people say .x, no offense, it's just, I feel like .exe is the more, you know, right way of saying it, but okay. Um, Dusk, what up? Apparently this is the game developer. I thank you for taking the time to buy and play this game, but before we begin, I feel I should explain a few things and set up what you can expect to experience here. Uh, okay. Alright. This is a horror game, so I recommend playing in the dark and with the lights off with headphones, uh, first of all. Call it a horror ritual, if you will. People have to kind of allow themselves to be immersed. Okay. So I, it's currently daytime, so there's no way I can record in the dark right now, but all right. This game is actually 11 games, technically. They are from some old notebooks, VHS tapes, and cassettes I wrote and recorded stuff to in the late 90s and early 2000s. Smart idea. I got into game development when I was 10, when a friend named John introduced me to game development software at the time called Games Factory. Uh, these days, the more modern version goes by Click Team Fusion, I think. Okay. I spent so much time making dorky games that would never see the light of day. They weren't good, but they were fun to make. And when I wasn't making them, I was writing ideas and notebooks and recording with this cheap camera my dad got me for a previous Christmas. Alright. I, I recently remembered about these projects and went down memory lane when I found one of my old notebooks. Most of them weren't horror game ideas. In fact, most were just fan games, as I used to be a huge scaredy cat. But I think I was also deep down interested in horror and dark, twisted things. Just, I was too scared to put the pieces together to realize it. I would have nightmares if anything that ended up scaring me too much. That shit would stick with me. I, I actually started to gain inspired by my dreams, though, and eventually I stopped finding them scary and more inspirational I guess I guess I kind of just started venting this part of me I wasn't even really aware of or maybe purposely ignored into these ideas I would have anyways I don't want to keep you guys waiting too long for the first game so we'll get right into it these games are recreations not the original games I made and never finished I've made a few changes to them such as replacing copyright content and such to make it so I can sell this I also thought it might be fun to make this into a community effort, so the next game will only be unlocked for everyone once some conditions are met in the game. 
there is a red circle, a blue triangle, and a yellow square hidden in- I heard about this already. When you find them, and if no one else has found them, yeah. I heard just about that. take a screen cap or a video for proof. There's 11 games in total, and they'll be unlocked one by one. I think that's about it? Well, also, you can resize the window by clicking and dragging the sides of the screen. I F12 that. to take a Steam screenshot. Yep. And F4 to switch between windowed and full screen mode. Then full screen. Okay. With all that said, let's get started with game one. Alright. Yep, game one attended. I knew it was called attended, but I wasn't 100%. So here we are. <sighs> I'm so fucking bored right now. My phone's dead from watching videos. The other person that was assigned night shift bailed, and there's not even any customers tonight. God, this is such a drag. I guess the manager did say if I had any spare time tonight to do a few chores around here, and there's truly nothing better to do, so. Ugh, fine. I need to kill time anyways. Okay. Let's turn that down just a little so I can hear myself. But, okay, here we are. Um, this is game one attendant, apparently. Let's, uh, can we read this? Read note? Yes. Ina. I'm guessing this guy is It's either Ina or Hina, I don't know. I'm gonna guess Ina for now. Ina, if you have any spare time on your shift tonight, could you mop up the mess the guy before you left? Wait, hold on. Could you mop up the mess the guy before you left up? You quit last second and left some photos around. I know it's a bother, but it really helped me out. I think there's like six photos around. You can take them up from the storage closet. You don't need to do this, but it'd be great help if you did, manager. Okay. So... Playing as I'm, get, I'm guessing we're playing as a chick in like a convenience store. Okay. Is it the storage closet? What's this? Storage closet. Oh! Listen to, okay, so it's locked. There should be a key around it. Okay, so there's a key somewhere. Here. Oh. Is that a note? Looks like a note. This place continues to decay. I don't know why we even tried at this point. This town is so far from any major roads or destinations that no one comes around these parts anymore. Not since the mining industry fell under, at least. And no one in this sick town cares about theater, that's for damn sure. We stopped putting up plays months ago, and no one's even bad in Island. It's almost impressive how much no one cares around here. More people keep moving out, places continue to close down, the government keeps trying to buy out the land and evict us. Damn. We're the ones to let the town right away. Watch as, it, as all of its avenues close down. Yep, but stubbornly stay here like they're damn proud of this place, but yet you can't seem to care about anything except their own piece of the pie. I've always wanted to be an actor, but this place is a dead end for my career. I don't know why I even had a, even, whoa, I'm reading way too quick. I don't know why I even once had faith in any of it. I guess you can consider this my registration notice. I could just leave, and I don't think anyone here would care or even notice. Thanks for wasting my fucking time, Miles. Jeremy. Okay, so I'm guessing Miles is the manager's name. But we're really looking for a key right now. So, I mean, I really don't have to use my mouse at this point because it's really just WA, WASD keys and enter E or one other thing. I'm gonna just go on the side just, uh, music is gone. Oh, never mind. Maybe here? Oh! Wow! I... I was not expecting to actually get that. Okay, it's the key for the storage closet. Okay, 
Okay, I think Q is inventory. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so we got our inventory. Let's head back inside. Let's get the mop so we can clean this place up. Alright, so we said there's six puddles, so. Alright, there's one. Oh, we didn't go in the bathroom. Okay, so there's one there. There's, okay, there's one in there. Okay, so that's two. And there's two in here, so that's four. And then there's like five, six. I think there's one outside, and there's gotta be one in there. Uh, there we go. This. A puddle of murky water sits below your feet. Mop it? Yes. It gives me undertale. That kind of like undertale. You got you know you know what I mean? Like they'll say something like that, and then they'll ask you a question like, should you do this or should you do that? Like, do you? You know what I mean? Music just disappeared. That does not sound good. Just, I don't like like you just have music disappear like that. Like uh, you play two soundtracks and then it just disappears. That's like that's a little frightening. You know, so far so good, dude. I don't see anything go wrong. Is there a puddle out here? Oh, we didn't check back here. Did we? No, I don't believe we did. It's back here. Oh, there is something here. What is this? It's a cellar door. It's shut tight. Was there a new looking lock? Okay. Oh, there was one in the, um, we didn't get the one in the, uh, girls' bathroom, I don't believe. Or did we? No, we didn't. That might have been the last one, but I swear there was, that was only five. Someone's, alright, someone's calling the phone. What do you want? I'm coming. Who would be calling this late at night? I don't know. What the? What the fuck? Uh, hello? Who, who is this? They should really have someone else like working here. Question, hang up. Threat, I'm not threatening this dude. That is none of your damn business. Now who is this? If you don't cut the crap and stop acting like a goddamn creep, I'm going to call the cops. Good, do it. Hang up, do it now. Stop! I'm really gonna call the cops. Please do. Would you notice me if I came naked? Bro, okay. Okay. Would you notice me if I was covered in blood? Would you notice me if I lived down the back of your neck? No, bro. Shut up. I'm about to kick this dude's ass. Fucking notice me, bitch. I'm calling for you. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Some people are messed up in the head. Yeah. I really right. do hate customer service. 
I need to think about getting a new job. Yeah, just leave the place, dude. Why is the phone not working? Why is that back up? Can I do anything here? It's my locker, but there's nothing there. Just decide, okay. Bro, why does that keep going up? Okay, everything, everything in here so far is okay. I still don't know why the phone is not working. Go back in there? I, like, dude, I don't know what else would be in here. What the hell is that? What in the hell? What is that? Who, who did this? Is there someone else here? Even if it were some other employees oh. playing a dumb prank on me, this has gone way too far. I want to get out of here, but of course I don't have a car and my phone is dead. I can't call anyone to pick me up. Stay calm, Lina. You just have to get through the rest of your shift and then Carla will come and pick you up. I just have to make it to the end of my shift. Like that ass, I don't know what else to do. I don't know if this is supposed to happen. If I'm supposed to go outside. Oh shit! Bro, sitting on the train in the shadow of you. That scared the shit out of me. To your knees where my hands lay down. Oh my god, bro, what the hell? Eyebrows, which are starting to frown. And trees go passing by. I see trees go passing by. I see the air is seen. For real? That's how it ends? Nah, there's gotta be more. And the trees go passing by. There's gotta be more than just that. Is it really gonna end just like that? You should kill him, that's it. Nah. Dude, there's gotta be more than this. Yeah. That's weird. Probably all the games are out right now, but still. Like oh, to be continued in game two. Oh, oh crap! Unlock no shoes, no. Closes. Huh? How does wait, bro? How? Like what? 
I mean, all right. I guess that's how we gonna roll. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Drop a comment down below what you guys want to see next. If you guys want to see game two, let me know. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.